Another headline here from uh, Senator Lisa Murkowski, the Alaska senator. She may leave the party, she says, over the quote-unquote Trump uh, mania. So she's the type of Republican who just doesn't fit in, right? And this party hasn't for years, uh, by the way. But maybe Denise speaks to this larger issue that the party has and whether or not it will consolidate around Trump and there's enough there to win. What do you think? Yeah, Senator Murkowski has nothing to lose by leaving the GOP at this point. 60% of Alaskans are declared independents, and she's always voted consistently with Democrats as well as Republicans. I mean, there's, she's just a straight up the line moderate. And she, she won as a write in once. Well. Remember when she and lost so the primary years ago? Or? Yeah, she won in yeah. 2010. Yeah. Shocking. I mean, the strength of her name ID based on her father's legacy and her long history in public service in Alaska mm -hmm. really speak to the strength of her brand. And so, what we really need to do as a party, as a Republican, is we need to ensure that we keep her on board because we're trying to flip the Senate. Right. And so losing another Republican isn't helpful, even if she caucuses with us. It's still that, you know, we'd rather have someone that's a sure bet than somebody who's a maybe. And I think that we really need to work hard to keep you her know, and everyone who's ideologically diverse in the party. Let me ask, end it this way. Uh, Kurt, do you have any advice for Senator Murkowski? I know you know some people that have, um, you know, used to work for Republicans and don't anymore. Yeah, I mean, as someone who worked for a very independent senator in Olympia Snow <laughs> back in my days on Capitol Hill, I can tell you, Olympia, uh, she, she outright just left politics altogether. Uh, we've seen her her counterpart, Susan Collins, struggle with this very type of conundrum. Uh, I think Lisa uh, needs to just follow her heart. Yeah, and, and again, she proved it doesn't matter what your ballot designation is. She won without the Republican primary electorate. She won in, in spite of losing the Republican Party, running as an independent. So for her in Alaska, there's a path beyond just being a member of this party. Right. And it seems like it seems more like, though, she's not leaving the party. The party left her. And that's, I think, how she feels about it. All right, Kurt and uh, Denise, thanks. Good panel today as we continue here. New